Philippians 1 6 completion and suffering for righteousness and I am sure of this that he who began a good work in you will bring it to completion at the day of Jesus Christ we need to understand that we need to be perfected our heart is deceitful above all things and desperately wicked doesn't matter if you're saved or not we need God to work on us study after study has shown that if we're placed in the right circumstances we will do we will commit almost any kind of crime this includes taking innocent lives so Jesus was crucified in our place not because of the wicked acts that we did but because of the wickedness of our hearts all it takes is for us to be placed in the right circumstances in order us in order for us to realize our potential for human evil and so Christ works on us through suffering righteously so that he can change our hearts so that no matter what circumstances we are facing, we will behave in a godly way. A lot of people, their excuse for not giving away money is that someone will take advantage of them. That's suffering for righteousness. You then do your homework a little bit better. You don't give to that person. But when you were taken advantage of, you were suffering for righteousness. We need to embrace suffering for righteousness. In the case of us being TIs, if we can learn, and it's not about learning, it is about God manifesting himself in us in such a way that we can love the agents of this program. This program, God will utilize it to build up our character and our integrity in Him so that no matter of the circumstances, we will behave godly. In, in Schnazi Germany, most people would not help the innocent Jews. Okay, there were a few who did because they would rather lose their lives. They would rather be put in a concentration camp. They would rather be imprisoned or even, like I said, have their lives taken than to take innocent lives. And that's the kind of character and integrity that God wants to produce in us. If we let him work, utilize the TI program to help shape us and to purify us by allowing us to suffer for righteousness sake. And by that, I simply mean we have not done anything to deserve to be a member, to be put into the TI program. It's our wicked hearts that God is purifying. doesn't mean you actually acted on that wickedness, but God purifies that wickedness out of our hearts. Embrace suffering for righteousness sake. Like, subscribe, share, comment, any combination thereof. God bless.